Sixers Internet, welcome back to another episode of Blinding Corey While Driving, not safe, of Number Six with Cheese After Hours. Uh, today we are doing, yeah, you read that title, you saw that thumbnail, the Culver's Meat Mountain. I didn't know Culver's had a meat mountain, it doesn't. They do. We, uh, well actually, Corey's genius, because he always thinks best when we're outside of a Culver's. He thought to himself, why don't we do the Culver's Meat Mountain? They got a bunch of different meats. So today, because of Scorpion Heat Seeker, Larry Gonzalez and Derek Boudreaux all donated $25 super thanks to fund this the Culver's Meat Mountain very pumped for uh, also we you guys know this we like to shout out people who support the channel we do that for people who buy our merch and so we've got a little bit of a merch shout out for Mr. Ryan Lackey what a legend he got himself a bottle of the regular Sixer sauce and the hamburger logo shirt nice much much appreciated Ryan anybody who wants to support the channel head on over to number six with cheese.com we got cool stuff for sale hot sauce shirts get it don't be dumb you know what they say you are what you eat so two meat mountains going to eat thyself let's go you guys a big old bag of meat and sauce a little bit of bun you'll see what we did uh, 41 bucks for all this acquired from Culver's <laughs> jump cut all right all right get <laughs> this time I'm, I'm so excited to show them the tower and I, I shouldn't be so excited but I am I said it before we're sitting outside the Culver's I'm excited to see what happens today because Corey's best ideas and some of his best episodes are outside of a Culver's this is the Corey Wagner second angle I'm not sure what we're getting into except for a couple of these items so we're just gonna go kind of randomly I do know first off they gave us this giant cup of Thousand Island which is total gentleman's move. We didn't even ask for Thousand Island. They just know that we got the pot roast. No, it's for the Reuben. Is oh, the, for the Reuben? Yeah, the Reuben. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right, that's right, that's right. No, you're an idiot. So first up, okay, okay, cool. This is the uh, pork tenderloin. Yeah. Beast. Wow, a big one. Big boy. We got onions, pickles, mustard, and ketchup on there. This is gonna be the base. It felt like the thing that was gonna get the uh, bun the least amount of moist. So actually, I'm gonna get this knocked out right away with a little bit of Thousand Island on here. Okay, did I go a little too much? Maybe. Then we've got, this is the bucket o beef. <laughs> Fucking a roast beef. That's pot roast. Don't, pot roast. don't say roast pot beef. Roast. This ain't no Arby's, dude. So we're just gonna kind of layer this on, and then I'll take a little finger amount. Oh, this is damn good. Yeah, it's good when there's no soggy bun. You want some? Yeah, of course. That's like actually pretty good. Looks kind of like cat food, but that's okay. You gotta get past that. <laughs> It's so tender and okay. so salty and so good. All right, next up, those are backup bun. We got a secondary bun just in case we need it. This is the spicy crispy chicken sandwich. So we'll take that patty. I don't think you and I have ever had chicken from Culver's. I don't think we have, bud. All right, and we've got this. A lot of these we try to get them without the bun. Look at that smashed up piece of beef. Yeah, dude, they do it right. This has got bacon and cheese on it. With the paper, we'll just yeah, look at that. It's like it was mm, meant to be done. It's our cheese, though. Well, it's there's worse things. And then, yeah, this is the last thing. Oh, I remember. I don't. It's corned beef. Yeah. Just a pile of corned beef. <laughs> this is way better than the Arby's version. This honestly is, and I love that we created it. And corned beef's pretty damn good, too. You gotta try this. I wonder if you go in there and ask them to make this what they would charge you and if they would do it. How much for that? I mean, that's a meat mountain right there. It's not not a meat mountain. Right. Their meat is very good. That corned beef and that extra pot roast was like surprisingly good. Yeah. All right, real quick on the big camera because we got it. Here the cross section is. Guys, uh, super thanks for the absolute work that Corey just put in on this <laughs> Also, thank you to the heroes who donate for this. You could tell me and Sean wanted to do this. Larry, Derek, and Scorpion Heatseeker. You know what I always think of? I think of the other Derek with us too. Derek Strong? Derek Strong was a big meat mountain guy for Arby. I, hope, yeah. I, I know he's gonna see this and I hope he's proud. He was in the second Meat Mountain episode we did at That's Arby's. right. I have a lot of experience, guys. You have your uh, masters from Columbia, right? In fast food history? All right, I've never been more excited for a sandwich in my life. The Culver's Meat Mountain. Hey, people in Wisconsin, and give this video a like. Cheers. Cheers. 
Mm. Oh, wow. That's a pretty good bite. Not bad. It's really good. Here's why it's so good. Oh, man. And I'm comparing it to the only other meat mountain I ever had. That one had like no texture mm -hmm. and the meat was like cold both yep. times. Yep. This is piping hot. There's sauce, there's pickles. The crisp of the chicken and the pork. Yes, the pork tenderloin, I was going to say, does it for me. That's what brings it all together. The, the crispiness of that pork tenderloin is batch <laughs> as this is. It's pretty damn good. Uh, it's pretty good. Son, don't talk with your mouth full. Yeah, this should be horrible, but it's not. It's really good. I mean, this is a challenge to eat, tasting nonetheless. Culver's does a really good job deep frying their meats. Like the pork and the yep. chicken is honestly a very nice texture. And this beef tenderloin, like everything's working together. Mm -hmm. I gotta get some sticker sauce on this. You got a free hand to grab that? Mm -hmm. What an iconic moment for our hot sauce. What an iconic moment for America. <laughs> I cannot get over how good the texture is. Also dude, the red onion. Raw dog in it too. That's I love good. raw onions. Red onion specifically. That's the best raw onion you can get. Grilled or raw dog? I'm the raw dog. Raw is the raw. I'm going right on. I'm just going to put it mm. right on mm. the bite. Mm. <laughs> He's moaning and groaning. This is, a, this is a heart attack, but I don't care. So be it. Welcome I mean, America. don't eat this a lot. My dad always said you should do everything in moderation. Same. My mom says that too. This is not moderation. <laughs> <laughs> is it still moderation if you do it once every seven years like us? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I can only do one more bite and it's gonna be this is just like too much yeah well yeah i mean every bite is I'm like it's like bite. having basically a sandwich <laughs> <laughs> it's really nice with the sixer sauce too it provides a little sweetness with the honey in it balances it out a little bit mm -hmm. that's about balance son don't talk with your when you came up with this idea i was like that's a fun dumb video i can't believe how much i like it i didn't expect it to work out this well no i thought this is going to be one of those quad rib <laughs> travesties yep or meat mountain travesties for that matter those were never that great and they were making them in the store this stuff goes together pretty well. All their meats are pretty delicious. Mm -hmm. This is kind of a win. Arby's, I remember there just being a lot of cold, like deli cut meat. Like, and the cheese wasn't heated up. It this is the deli all... meat here. The corned beef's warm. Everything's hot. Culver's not even entering the game and still beating Arby's at their own game. Arby's, that's sad. That is sad. That's a tough day. Arby's needs to change their motto immediately. 100%. We got the meats is out. We used to. We used to have, <laughs> we gave the meats to Culver's. Should be their new slogan. <laughs> they stole the meats. Yeah. Man, I hate so much of this. This is all I have left. I am like almost looks like a pot dog. Second by this. <laughs> Guys, how about this? What fast food restaurant do you want to see us do the next meat mountain? We gotta keep trying. Because of this guy's ideation, good. we basically stumbled into being the meat mountain channel. We've done Arby's yeah. twice, we've done Culver's. What's next? McDonald's, Burger King. Yeo! We this might... car is backing up so close that they probably got a camera. Also, I, I totally trapped them in. This is my fault. Can you imagine them looking in that camera and seeing this? Those are weird. Anyways, they gotta pick a spot. Sorry, we got distracted by almost getting back then too. What's the next place? And then donate again. Let's try to get to 100. You can go together, like a bunch of people donate to 25. You can do fives and tens, whatever. If we get to 100, we'll also do the Meat Mountain at the place that's, made, let's say, voted on the most in the comments. Yeah, I love that. Sorry, I just saw a shadow of someone. I keep getting so distracted. I saw a silhouette of someone behind our car. Oh, it was a guy on a bike. Oh, Jesus. I thought we were getting broken into. Jesus wants a bike. My focus is off. The Meat Mountain got my ADHD rolling. This is all I left. Did you eat basically the same amount or more? I, that's probably about the same amount. Okay, then I'm going to stop. You should. I want us to finish together. Also, hack that Sean found. If you order on the app, you can ask for no buns on most of those. I'm, I do not see a world, Corey, somebody beats that. I don't see McDonald's, mm. Burger King, maybe Wendy. There's I, not enough meats anywhere else. It's just going to be burger, chicken, nugget. <laughs> Let us know which one also makes the most sense to do next. Yeah. Not just burgers and chicken and fish. Like, we want it. That, this one was so diverse. Having, like, corned beef and pot roast. My pot roast. Well, should we rate it? Is this a rateable thing? Do we just enjoy the experience and everyone knows that we enjoyed it? How about this? Why we don't put we a number on? Why it? don't just as we do these, we rank them where rank. Culver's is in first. Culver's is number one. And Arby's, because we've done two, is in second. Yeah, that's a, you if they're in last place. Take that. So yeah, I'd rather say they're in they're last, in last place, place than in second. Place. They're in last place. Yeah. Arby's is in last place, and they've had two goes at it. Yeah. And a really charming guest, and I still hated it. Sorry. I wonder if I said I hated it or I was being nice. It sucked. Sometimes we're nice when guests are in the car. Yeah, and I care more about Derek than I do about Arby's. Yeah. That's true. All right, well, comment below what place we should do next for the Meat Mountain. Donate a little bit on Super Thanks or Venmo, PayPal, whatever. And if we get to 100, we'll do it so that we can actually, like, we're at work right now. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's fun and games, but what if you went to work and they were like, we're only going to pay your electric bill, nothing else? <laughs> <laughs> what do you need to survive? Yeah. We'll give you, we'll give that you amount. exactly that amount. Uh, I'll give you $3. Well, what if I want to get like one big, shut up. It'll give you $3 a month. <laughs> I need new shoes. No, I said I shut up. Stop talking about things you need.
<laughs> All right, well, this was super fun. Um, you guys, a blast. Also, Ryan, thanks again for buying merch. Yes. Num number six with cheese.com to support. If you want to get the sauce we used today in the episode, you can. A bunch of ways to support two knuckleheads just having fun in the car hanging out. So, um, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and uh, we'll see you for the next Meat Mountain. Oh, the Meat Mountain guys. journey rolls on. I keep this train rolling. I love these guys. I'm going to have to do a couple of those chin smacks. Wait, do we ask him a question? Yeah, we. Uh, wh which one we should do next? Okay, cool, cool. cool, 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 cool. <laughs> like and subscribe. We love you. YouTube forever. Bye.